Hey there, it's Fox Tech, and in this video, we're going to discuss how to check the touch screen of your iPad. If you want to ensure that your touch screen works in every area and responds accurately to touch, this video is for you. We'll explore some different methods to test your iPad's touch screen and even determine if it's an authentic display. So let's get started. The first method to check your iPad's touchscreen is by using a checker app. Open up the App Store and search for a checker app specifically designed for iPad screens. There are several apps available for this purpose. One example is a simple app that allows you to slide your finger across the screen and it will display the coordinates of your touch. If the coordinates change as you slide your finger, it indicates that the touchscreen is working correctly. This app also counts touches and changes color, making it easy to see if the screen responds in all areas. You can also explore other apps that offer more functions, and some may require a small fee for more in-depth information. Apart from testing if your touchscreen works, you might also want to ensure that your iPad screen is authentic. Here are some tips to help you with that. First, check if Touch ID or Face ID is functioning correctly. If Touch ID or Face ID works without any issues, it suggests that the display is likely authentic or replaced with an authentic one. Next, look for signs that the display may have been taken off and replaced. Look for creases or gaps between the display and the iPad body. These signs could indicate that the display has been tampered with. If you suspect any issues with the authenticity of your iPad's display, it's best to take your device to an Apple store. They have the expertise to verify the authenticity of the display and can assist you further if needed. In conclusion, checking your iPad's touchscreen is essential to ensure that it works correctly in all areas and responds accurately to touch. You can use a checker app from the App Store to test the touchscreen's responsiveness, and there are different apps available, some with more features for a small fee. Moreover, you may want to verify the authenticity of your iPad's display by ensuring that Touch ID or Face ID functions correctly and looking for any signs of tampering, such as creases or gaps. I hope you found this video helpful in understanding how to check your iPad's touchscreen. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to Foxtech for more useful tech tips and tricks. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Until next time, peace.